Alright, in this video I'm going to show you how to take a GitHub project, GitHub Java project, specifically a classic video game, and import it into Eclipse and run it. So the first thing we're going to do is get on, log into GitHub and create that GitHub account if you don't already have one. So I'm going to search for a classic game, Frogger. I'm going, to fil I'm going to filter by Java and here the second one in the list by Vitalius I happen to know is a, is a pretty good version so over here on the HTTPS clone URL I'm going to click this to copy it to the clipboard go over to my Eclipse and I'm going to go to the Git perspective now you have a Java perspective There we go. And then uh, make sure that your Eclipse has the Git perspective. And you may need to install a plugin. You can easily search on Google uh, how to make sure that you have this. But you want to open a perspective. And you can see the Git perspective is what you want. OK, so in Git, what I want to do is click this middle one which is clone a git repository and add the clone to this view and that's what we're doing we are cloning the git repository from github into our git repositories on our local uh, our local file system here so when I click that it will automatically paste it in because that was that's what was on my clipboard. Automatically paste it into the URI. And all you need to do is click next. Master branch, click next. And here I have set up uh, my Git repositories to be under my username and then the subfolder Git and then the name of the project, uh, Frogger. So I finish and it is copying the repository down from GitHub. And now I need to switch over to my Java perspective here. I'm going to right click over here and I'm going to import a project from Git existing local because I just created the local repository because I cloned it. Next, Frogger, that's what I want. Next. Now here you want to import using the new project wizard. You want to import using the new project wizard. I'm going to finish. And I do want a Java project. I'm going to click next. All right, I'm going to call the project Frogger, but I'm not going to use the default location. So <clears throat> my default location would be um, my workspace uh, directory. But remember, I cloned the Git repository into a directory called Git. So I'm going, I'm going to browse and find, I'm going to point my workspace I'm going to basically point my workspace, uh, which is in my username and my git folder, and then Frogger. So this directory was created when I cloned the repository in that first step. So I'm going to open that repository. So normally, like I said, when I create projects, Normally it would point to my, <coughs> excuse me, my Eclipse workspace. But here I am telling it the location is the Git repository on my local, my local machine. So all I need to do is hit finish. source it's all compiling and now I can 
right click run as Java application. It's wanting to know well what is the starting point of the Java application. In this case it's main Frogger and it will only ask me this once. Let's click OK. Starting. Takes a few seconds here. And there we go. So we have successfully cloned a Java project from GitHub, the Frogger video game, and we have imported it into Eclipse and uh, successfully run the, run the project. You should be able to do these same steps for many other Java projects that are in GitHub and getting them into Eclipse and being able to run them. There will be occasional exceptions uh, where you might have to uh, fix certain things depending on what version of Java uh, it's compatible with, for example, or a few other few other things. And you can usually troubleshoot uh, the error messages you get and figure it out. Thank you very much. I hope this was helpful.